In this video, we are going to show you how to create campaigns using Social Cedar. The point of campaigns is that you're going to ask your ambassadors to send the content that you sent them. So in order to create a campaign, we need ambassadors, but lucky for us, we have amazing one ambassador. So let's go to activate. Here you can see your active campaigns. You can see your drafts, scheduled, ready to send and archived. If you want to create a campaign, you can just click here. But for the purpose of this video, let's just edit a campaign I already prepared. So the first thing you'll do when you have to create a campaign is choose a language. At the moment, it's on English, so let's keep it on English. Then in the link to campaign URL tab, you paste a link to either a website or a video, and then it'll automatically paste the picture and edit the title and description. In order to show you how this works, let's quickly copy another link. Let's paste it. And you can see everything changes. You can edit the title and description manually just by typing here. And with these buttons, you can select the platforms that you want your message to be shared on or allow your ambassadors to share on. So for example, if I take Facebook, you can share it on Facebook. Let's do next. Now we come to the filter screen of the ambassadors. So let's click show filters, click English. And then let's say that this is a campaign that I want to send to my employees. So let's select the segment employees. And you'll see that's the one ambassador we have. Let's click engage. And then we come to the mail page. We will select the English language. And then you can see the different options here to edit. You can also upload a custom banner if you want. And then here you write your mail. So let's paste the mail I already prepared. Let's insert the first name. And then you can send the test mail if you want to, but for the purpose of this video, let's just go to the launch. As you can see, everything is ready. We can schedule a launch if we want to, select a date and an hour, but let's just launch now. So now the campaign should be sent. Let's go to the email and we can see that there's a mail here. This is the mail that we've created. They're asking me to share. So let's click on the I'll share button. And now you can see the seeding page. So here I can say, I want to share on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, whatever I want to. Let's click on Facebook. And you see, it's very easy. I can now write a message. This is amazing. And if I want to, I can post it to Facebook. So in the next video, we'll explain to you how you can see your campaign analytics. I hope that this video was helpful and thank you for watching.